Mike. Right, Mike. Most of you would probably want to breathe for a little while if you've done what I've done here tonight, huh? No. And just to let you know how truly amazing the power of God is, this lift that you're seeing right here, about four years ago over in Muskogee, Oklahoma on a Saturday, we did this lift every 30 minutes for four hours. Oh. Nine times in one day. Wow. Like I said, I know a lot of you have been looking at me wondering, how is that possible? <laughs> well, I'll share that with you in a moment. First, let me ask you a quick question. How many of you out there like the way that my wife sings? Yeah. Amen. Well, let me tell you what. She sings so good that in just a moment here, when we sing together, it's still going to sound okay. <laughs> a song that has become very important to us over the last several years. And when we sing this song, I will guarantee you, you're immediately going to recognize the tune. However, the words are going to seem a little bit different from what you expect with this tune. But I'm hoping that from the colors we wear, you'll understand very quickly why we chose the tune that we do. And very quickly after that, you'll understand why we chose the words that we do. Get a mic check on her and make sure it's on. Ten, ten. There we go. Oh, say can you see God's earthly light who so proudly they hailed at the sight of his healing. Who stripes and his scars through his perilous fight and the righteous they watched from the twilight's first gleaming and the crowds that were there the cross raised in the air gave proof through the
And if it's as strong as it can possibly be, then it should be able to support seven times the body weight of that person. In other words, if there's a 200 pound man and his thigh bone's as strong as it can be, then you should be able to take 200 times seven and get 1,400 pounds that that man should be able to support. Now, I don't know about you, but if there's a 200 pound man standing up here with 1,400 pounds on his back, would you want to walk underneath? <laughs> yeah, me neither. That would be stupid. That's not normal. That's if everything is perfect. Now, if you take my body weight and round it to about 130 pounds and multiply it by 7, you get 910. So according to medical science, 910 pounds is the most weight that my body can support. Not lift, just support. If any more than 910 pounds is placed on my body, then every bone supporting it, which is pretty much all of them, would be crushed, shattered, and broken. That's what medical science says. But why don't you go ahead and show them how much is on the bar right now. So according to medical science, for those of you clapping and cheering, I'll assume you didn't listen to what I said could happen to me. Or you watch too much fake wrestling. But according to medical science, if I get underneath that bar and try to lift it right now, somebody better have 911 on hold because I am a dead man. That's I what medical him. science says. But you know what? I don't believe that tonight medical science has heard of the power of God. And we're going to prove medical science wrong right now. Go ahead, brother. Amen.